Okay, I've opened up uh, Illustrator here, and I'm going to select the pen tool. And what I've done here is I've changed the uh, fill color here to none, just by simply clicking here. And I'm just going to use a red stroke, just so it's easier for you to see. And I'll just bump this up a little bit. Now if you're going to be wanting to draw straight lines, if I just click here, and then I hold down the shift key, that will make a perfectly straight line for me. Now if I want to put another line next to it, you see if I click here, it will join. So I'm going to Apple Z to undo that. Now if I hold down the Apple key or the Command key, and I just click in this outside area, it will deselect for me. So if I click here again, hold down the Shift, you see it makes a straight line for me. Command key and click. And you see if I do it again horizontally, holding down the Shift again, it does it for me as well. And that's hold down the Command key and outside click to escape. Now let's say if I wanted to make a curve line similar to like a wave, I'm going to click here and I'm going to hold and I'm going to pull this little handle and then I'm going to click my next point and then the next and I'm going to pull up. So you notice the handles kind of move in the direction of uh, the line. So you only need to uh, click and pull when you want to change the direction. Now if I want to repeat this line again, of course I have to do the command and then click. So I'm going to click, pull, click and drag, click and drag. And Apple click to deselect that. Whoops. I'll do Apple Z. I'll do Apple click again. So click, drag, and we can still alter these uh, later on. So if I want to make kind of like an arch shape, see I'm going to, oh, let me escape from that one. I'm going to click, pull this up, and then I'm going to click and pull this down. And I'm going to press the command key again to escape. So I click, I'm going to pull, and click, and I'm going to hold down the shift key and see what happens. As you can see it kind of snaps it for me. Now if I want to say make a like an M or a double hump, I'll just escape again. So I'm going to click and drag up and then click and drag down. Now I can let go here, hold down option, and I can put this back up and then just do it on this side here. So I'm going to erase these. So I'll do it again another way. If I click and drag, click and drag, and I'm not going to let go. I'm still holding down the mouse, and I hold down Option, and I move this up, and then let go, and click and drag straight down. Now if I try again here, and I'll do command and click, so I'll click and drag, and I'm going to hold down shift, click and drag this way, and then hold down option, and bring that handle back over, and let go.